and we're live. We kind of got off the gaming thing, a, well, okay. a sidebarred it anyway. I heard, I, I was playing some games last night, and I heard, and somebody was like, Woody's visiting the prison you were at, Kyle, and I'm Dude. like, <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I'm, no. I'm, I'm like, he flew over, they're like, no, he landed. <laughs> <laughs> we were trying it's to rescue mission. Snow. <laughs> it's, a, it's, a, it's a rescue mission, they're, they're getting snow. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So would you free cam it and go around the prison? Uh, well, we we didn't oh. we did manage to successfully land. We didn't take off successfully, so poor Snow's done. But uh, <laughs> and you, yeah, and now you, now you're locked up with him. <laughs> yeah. But um, you know the the chat had these ideas on where they wanted to go. So so I'm dressed up in my like Amelia Earhart I, hat yeah. and goggles and the scarf and shit, and uh, we're going from place to place. So it's like, where do you want to go? Find the closest airport to Mount Everest. You launch and you get there, and um. The we went to my house, we went to Mount Everest, we went to the pyramids, and one of the Did places you go to Epstein's Island. We went to Epstein's Island. Yeah. We went to Conway yeah. and did a flyby of both Wendy's. <laughs> 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 and, um, An eventful and, stream. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, they wanted to see Talladega, Talladega Federal Penitentiary. Uh, you know, they were really into that. And it turns out it has a really big, like, grassy area with no trees that we could land in. So we checked mm. that out. That was one of, one of the more successful locations because it looked good. Epstein's Island. It doesn't it have a house with like a gold roof it's, or something? Yeah, it's got like sat, a temple on there. No, it's sat up like they, I realized when I flew over, and I'm sure you, oh, did, you did when too. you flew over. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure you realized it when you tried to go to your house or or if you did that. But like, they basically there's a house there, great, and then they have AI generate what the AI would assume a building would look like. So like my house from where I grew up has like the garage, like a garage door, a door on the back side and then another garage on the front like it's just ai generated my house building. in hmm. microsoft flight simulator is yeah. fucking awesome it looks like <laughs> my house it, wait it, really dude it's really good it, i what the fuck i feel like i got maybe because mine had a bunch of tree cover or something i but think it has to do with the density like so my observation is this we'll see if it changes with more if the how if the building kind of stands alone the modeling is really good if it's one of many buildings in a neighborhood, they just kind of genericize all. Gotcha. Of that makes sense. So, like the uh, the prison actually had a bunch of standalone buildings, and they're not normal shapes. They're not like cookie cutter houses. They're yeah. I can't even describe it. Circles with like moon crescents coming off the side from from the air, and uh, and it did all of them really well. That prison looked just mm. like it did in Google Maps. How that game is fantastic. I've never like I had one of the most fun streams I've ever had. Just. I, I got a bunch of those little mini like uh, vodkas because they sell them at <laughs> the grocery store for some reason, and just got shit housed and started talking to ATC and like trying to fly around. I flew into the hurricane, which you can do with the live weather uh, oh, off cool. of Mexico. Like, like I was not expecting to enjoy it as much as I did. The only downside is there's no time skip. Like, there is. I That's wanted not the only downside. No, <laughs> there's time. Skip. My friend was trying to 9-11 the Freedom Tower. Oh, my God. And, yeah, and they've got a big protective off. bubble around that thing. What a bunch See, of cowards. That's, that's fascism. <laughs> I, I'd have programmed that, it. The original fucking... Microsoft Flight Sim advertises you can fly into the World Trade Centers. Look it up. 1998 Flight Sim, the commercial and, and or the uh, the uh, like intro video. He's like, maybe we'll fly into the Twin Towers. That's really? it. I'm taking it old school. I let want me, that Let game. me try and find it. <laughs> yeah, get the yeah, I'm going with version. the 98 version. You know there's some purist out there who's like, who's was so excited, then tries to fly it in there. He's like, this sucks. Back to 98. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They're Patreons, Taylor. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> like, like, like every time a new Call of Duty comes out, you're just like, you know what? I'm, I'm just going back to COD 4. That's, it's, it's, just, it's just it's the purest in me. That's how <laughs> yeah. they are. They just really want to take out fucking... You know, I've been trying to hit the White House for the last 20 games, and they won't let me. Going back to 98. Yeah. I'm going to finish the job on the Pentagon, is what one of them. <laughs> <laughs> it was fun. I, uh, I'm i not sure what I'll do with my next stream. Like, it, We did a bunch of like 15, 20-minute flights, and I think that works pretty well at first. Everyone wants to see these, land, yeah. you know, these landmarks. Uh, but once you've seen them... Do people want like a just chatting with a flight sim in the background? I, that's that's the most me. boring part about flight sim. The, I'm sorry, not the most boring. The least enjoyable part for me as a streamer is when you're in the air and there's no danger at all. Like like when I flew to Vegas, really just wanted to fly to Vegas and see how that would work that's in true. a 747 
with no training. It was a mess, but it was great, mm -hmm. right? Like the fun part was getting out of LAX, taxiing, like trying to get out and then trying to land. And that was about it. The rest of the time, it was just kind of like, it was kind of like calming, soothing. You know, you're just like like, like a long road drive. So I just decided to do a QA. and a I think like media share would be a good idea, mm -hmm. but I'm certainly not, you know, you planes fly themselves, dude. Hit the autopilot button and just walk away. <laughs> like, go make dinner. Like, it's I gonna be a today. real flight today. I, yeah. So I, there's um, I dream of I, there's I do this thing in Georgia where I fly my paraglider. The pro trouble is it's a five or six hour drive, and I sometimes daydream of having a plane. So I'm like, today I'm gonna simulate that flight. Like 15 minutes into the actual flying part, I was like, fuck it, I'm going to take a shower. <laughs> I'll come back. Plane's still going. <laughs> day day two I mean, of the game. <laughs> fuck it. <laughs> well, did you see what did you see what Bruce uh, Green did? A little bit. Yeah, yeah. they did the, like the world's yeah. longest flight. It was like what? 16 hours. Or something. Yeah, so they rent. So they they set up inside of a 747 cockpit like they set up their stream and everything in there. And so they streamed from from the cockpit. And by all accounts, it, I watched a little bit here and there. Looked fun, but like again, like the pilots themselves are not doing too much in the middle of like the fifteen hour flight. Like they're they're just like uh, everything looks green, All right? And, and he talk. had like he had a couple people to like riff with yeah. and bounce off. Yeah. But like doing that alone, a sixteen hour stream alone is on autopilot. Like you guys that, didn't awful. see the part I saw, right? So I'm. I pop in. I think it was after PKN. I'm like, I'm going to see what this thing's about. I'm kind of interested in this game. I've been watching trailers for a year, and this is the biggest thing happening right now. There's like 15,000 people watching. And they're up there. They're at you know, 30,000 feet, so they must have been flying for a while when they realized that they didn't start with enough fuel. And mm -hmm. they're so like... They had to refuel. The, they, they, had, they started over. And they, they're like, they're, they had been going for a while, and they're like, well, I mean... I guess we should just start over and just restart the game. And this God, time, that's when you need one of those. It's a video game. Can't we call in like a refueling tanker or something to do this midair? Well, you, you can. can yeah. You can slide right. the fuel gauge to up and put it at a hundred if you want to. But yeah, you know, I, I look. I forgive them. I discovered that today. They didn't know it two days ago. Like that, it was the first night. But uh, yeah, you can go in there and just. Give I guess you wanted to do it legit, but oh. I mean, or you didn't you know. do it. I don't but, get that game. I don't get it because it seems like so monotonous. But but see, mm -hmm. I don't understand the truck driver simulator games, which it, I also enjoy playing for the same reason that it's funny for like me to stream. But I don't think I'd ever. It takes a spe like you have to really want to get into that mentality of like I would like to do the full start to end, talk to ATC, do the plane checkups. Like it's very in depth. It is not like I want to drive some trucks today, right? Like I did it for the concept. Is this about I, role playing? Yes. For, for okay. a lot of people and for the stream stuff, yeah. Like role playing and getting into ATC, like comms, and you can talk to people. Like that is what they want. They want to so, feel like they're really doing it. The interesting thing is, none of us play Call of Duty that way. <laughs> like, no. like, 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 none of us like role play yeah. Call of Duty. Like, we're a soldier. we got two like, bogeys and Green Top House or whatever the fuck. Talk we're we're yeah. gonna pin down behind a wall and start telling stories about home or anything. Yeah, but... <laughs> <laughs> that would be so fucking that was safe and talked about how you missed your mom. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Uh, yeah, Kyle Desert Storm was years ago. You have this. You got it. I believe in you. You can do it. Just pop, pop, pop. We stay here. We're dead, Gorpo. <laughs> like in Call of Duty, we're all jumping off buildings, doing th fucking three sixties. But as soon as it's a, a truck or a plane, we're like putting our pilot's cap on and fucking waving to the invisible stewardess behind us. Yeah. yeah. Have you have you seen the um? Have you seen the people that like role play? I can't remember the name of the game, but it's like uh, it's like a medieval, not medieval, like a civil war sim. So mm -hmm. like they all have to play an individual person in a unit and all the mics are on. So you have people going like giving pep talks on the line, like walking back and forth and then the cannons come and blow them up and they're like in character dying. It's like that's funny to watch, but I don't no, think that's... I could ever get involved. I could get into that role play. Fun. How you could get that little civil war role play? I could get into that. Oh jeez. Yeah.